Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of IMS Rides presented by Progressive. Riding these amazing machines is rarely about the endpoint, but rather where they take us and the experiences we have along the way. On this episode, we seek to get lost in the California desert with Tila LaRue and discover how motorcycling has profoundly and positively affected her life. Let's get going. This is the desert, where the art of getting lost is my way of life. My name is Tila. I'm based in Los Angeles. I'm a model, I'm an entrepreneur, my boy playmate <laughs> and motorcycle enthusiast. It's crazy to think that I've only been riding for three years, but it feels like so much longer. I had a history of, you know, depression and anxiety, and I just couldn't figure out a way to kind of express myself or, or deal with that, and riding has really done that for me. It's completely changed my life. It's completely changed the way that I see the world, and it allows me to be free and connect with nature and see beautiful parts of the world that I may have never paid attention to before. It is my therapy. <laughs> When I'm on the bike, I don't have any distractions. I am completely immersed into being on the road and being on the bike and not thinking about anything else but just being in that moment. When people ask like, what you're passionate about, like, this is in my heart. You ride through such beautiful areas and you really pay attention to the world around you that you don't have time to really think about the stress and the chaos that's going on in the world. I'm so stoked to see so many women out there riding. The challenge, you know, navigating the bike, I absolutely feel stronger physically, mentally, emotionally. You know, I feel empowered. I, I remember one message that I got from a dad and he was like, my daughter loves you and for her 16th birthday, I didn't get her a car, I got her a motorcycle. And that, that to me, like, that makes me, like, that gets me emotional because, like, I know that she's gonna experience the same sort of peace that I found, you know? So I love going out to Joshua Tree in the desert because it's a place for me to kind of get lost. There's something about going to the desert and finding the straightest road you can find and just completely getting lost down that road. There's so many cool places to explore in the desert. There could be like abandoned buses, <laughs> climbing up ginormous rocks and the energy that is that is based in the desert, the vibration. I think it makes it feel a little bit more out of this world. There's a, there's a stillness and, and a quiet um, away from the chaos. It just feels unique and different. I think that's why it's one of my favorite places. It's because it's just a place to kind of reset you know, your, your mind and your soul. It tells a story, it has a history and you can feel it. I find myself riding down this road and the sun's starting to set. I pull over, take off my helmet, feel the wind through my hair, the sun just kissing my face, and I watch the most epic sunset. The sky is changing colors, and you can see the trees becoming silhouette behind the sunset, and it's absolutely magical. It's not always about riding the bike, it's about where it takes you. It takes me to a place, you know, internally and emotionally, and it helps me connect with myself. My journey of riding is just beginning, and I know it's gonna take me to so many places, and I know I'm gonna continue to learn more about myself, and I'm gonna continue to grow. I have no destination where I'm going right now, but I've never felt happier. Now that's an inspiring story. If that doesn't get you excited to go out on a ride right now or learn how to ride a motorcycle, well, I don't know. Thank you, Tila, so much for sharing your story and additional thanks to Dylan Patrick for helping us film and edit that segment. We have more great episodes of IMS Rides and other video series on the horizon, so be sure to stay tuned. On our next episode, we're heading to Rawhide Adventures in Southern California for adventure motorcycle training. Our guest is gonna be Natalie Duran. She's a professional rock climber, fitness enthusiast, and American Ninja Warrior finalist. 
Don't forget to follow us on all of our social media channels, including Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. But also, be sure to subscribe to ContinueTheRide.com. That way, you can see all this awesome content we're putting together in one place and stay informed about the Progressive IMS Outdoor Tour, which is coming to a city near you in 2021. Until next time, everyone, remember, ride smart, ride safe. We'll see you out there on the road. Glamorous world of production. Making sure that your talent is warm on cold desert days. Ha, 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 ha.